Hey everyone. Um, in a previous video, I told you guys that I have some hobbies like gardening and fishing. Um, also tiki carving. This guy's doing pretty good. But anyways, I'm about to go fishing. So I figured I'd make a video about what that entails. I live on the water and it's brackish water. So I take my kayak out and you can catch things like redfish, flounder, trout, all great options. Lean white fish, great for prep. So this is my kayak. It's a foot pedal one. So you'll see once I get in the water, but it's an old town sportsman. That's a lookout with a rope. I'll make another video climbing that. There's some more tiki's, fireplace, and this is the water. So this part is very important. This is where I get in the water with my Burberry boots and pull out my kayak. Full steam ahead. River and it was dredged, I don't know, some amount of years ago that I don't know. And they created this island. So there's water on the other side of that. That's an island. That's also an island, but it's just a small island. But that island is called Quarantine Island. And ironically, while I was quarantined last year during coronavirus, I kayak there frequently. So I'm about to throw my line in, and I have this weedless jig head really good for redfish. This went on for quite some time, about two hours, but I did not catch anything. You, the guy she tells you not to worry about. Usually a bunch of flamingos sleep on this tree, but I don't see any right now. There's a very large bird in this tree. Let's see if I can sneak up on it. Ah. Oh shoot. Okay, we're out here again. High tide is at six, it's 5.40 p.m. What was that? There's a bunch of birds. I'm really tempted to just bother with these birds for a moment. They look so peaceful. These are sandpipers. Goodbye, sandpipers. dolphins so I'm abandoning the fishing idea we caught a fish but we gotta go see the dolphins let's go delfinos all right let's hang out with some dolphins I love seeing dolphins. It's like my favorite part of fishing. Except they eat all your fish, so. Ooh. So, I just got some dolphins breaching and I saw them come up over here, so I'm gonna try and find them again. Oh my gosh. They're 
over here. Shortly after this moment, I started an Instagram live video and kayaked with the dolphins until they left for the ocean. Now I'm going to show you guys how to fillet the redfish that I caught in three, two, one. This is a redfish. It's quite large. You can tell it's a redfish because of this distinctive dot on its tail. And when it's in the sun, it glistens and looks really red. It's really pretty color. Um, they're delicious to eat. When they're this big, with their, this is basically right at the limit size. Um, you have to really get under these large scales. They're pretty much the size of toonies. So you kind of got to get under one and then they all can come off. So I have my electric descaler here. I've never tried it on a redfish, so I'm going to see if it works. It has settings one and two. My sister got me this for Christmas, so thank you, Marissa. Ah! verdict with the electric descaler is it works amazing. Usually it takes like 10 minutes to take off the scales. It did it in less than like 30 seconds per side, maybe a minute, but it went really fast. So I have two knives, my Dexter, and I can't tell what brand this one is, but this one has a, a serrated edge and it's really good for cutting through thick rib cages. Um, this one's for fine meat. You can probably do the whole fish like this if you're really good. Um, with redfish, especially one of this size, I'll probably use both knives. So I just, I, I could do it with this, but I don't want to dull it because it's so sharp. So to fillet, you start from the ventral surface, go to the dorsal surface, right, right where its skull ends, and then you meet it up at the spine, and then you flip your knife 90 degrees and go right along the spine. pretty big fillet. Now you separate it from the bottom here. So you go right above. Here, I can do it this way too. Go right above the rib cage. Separate it so you don't have bones in your meat. Pretty big. <laughs> All right, here we go.
This is quite the fillet. Okay, here we have three fillets all weighed out and I season it with all-purpose Greek seasoning. Just a little bit of this. Garlic powder, tagine, and lemon pepper. I'm gonna cook it actually in the Breville at 375 for 15 minutes. All right guys, that was it. Saw some dolphins, caught some fish. That's it for my first Florida outdoor adventure video. Subscribe and let me know what you guys want to see more of. Thanks.